that I think somebody here in the audience is going to be able to guess. Now, I will give you three hints. And when you think you know what it is, you just yell it out for me, all right? Number one, this is a body part. Number two, we have them too. And number three, your dog at home uses this to find things. What do we think it is? Yeah, the nose. You guys are super smart. All right, the canine nose is very different from the human nose and well over 10,000 times more acute. This means we can train them to search for any odor known to mankind. This comes in very handy for mil military, canine, police search and rescue, things like that. Now, nowadays, dogs are even being trained in the conservation of endangered species, such as the Amor tiger and the ornate box turtle. Now before you, you will see five boxes, all identical in shape, size, and color. The way we train our dogs in nose work is we teach them to look for a specific odor. In this case, this is our hot box, and it has the odor of the essential oil of birch in it. So, I want to make sure that we keep this in a completely random location every time. So I would like a lucky number between one and six from one of you guys out here. And who's got a number between one and six? Anybody? Your right idea. Four, that's a great number. So we are gonna put our hot box in lucky number four. There we go. That is the box to keep your eyes on. Now when our dog thinks that he has correctly found that odor, he is going to strike a super cute pose for you guys. And that is when it is a great time to give him a big round of applause to let him know that he did it right. All right, so let's introduce our dog. This is a two-year-old Border Collie. He is my baby boy. He's the cutest dog in the whole world. In just a minute, you'll see why. Everybody put your hands together for cinema. Hi, baby boy. Hi, well, can I have that? He's gonna take a little bit of a lap and show you guys how cute he is. There he is. What a good boy. He says, here you go, Mom. Time to take the scenic route. Ready? Get up. Good boy. Wait. Can you, can you say hi to everybody? Can you wait? Good job. Very good boy. All right, bud. Back up. Lay down. Wait. All right, now, contrary to popular belief, him staying there is actually the hardest part. So you guys make sure you tattle on him if he gets up without me seeing. <laughs> right on cue, right? Hey, cinema. Down. Wait. Oh, she says stay. Perfect. You stay. <laughs> All right, he is going to start down here at box number one. And when he waits his way to box number four, hopefully we see that pose. Ready? Three. Come on, buddy. You ready? Search. Find it. Where is it? Where is it? Oh, he just asked the one. What a good boy. Now, ask his biggest reward. We're going to do some fun stuff. Ready? Spin, spin, spin. Good boy. Twist and twist. work cinema now cinema is the youngest member of our family it's just about a year and a half and a lot of folks ask us about the dogs in this show so i would love to tell you all that these are our dogs these are our pets and our family members and we love them all very much they sleep with us in bed they cuddle with us when we watch tv and every dog in this show we found and uh, brought into our homes either through a shelter a rescue or a private adoption so if you guys are looking to add a four-legged member of your family, we definitely suggest you check out your local rescues and shelters because there are some pretty incredible dogs out there just waiting to find the right home. Now that being said, we are going to be moving into what we call our Prey Drive Challenge. Prey Drive is a dog's natural desire to hunt, capture, and consume their prey. So for our Prey Drive Challenge, we're going to be asking our dogs to perform a number of behaviors running through this obstacle course. They're going to start up here, run through these 12 weaves, through the tire, through the tunnel, over these two jumps, around the barrel, back through those jumps, and out of the tunnel one more time, and that's when they will have earned the right to capture their prey. Now for this challenge, their prey will be 
uh, replaced with their favorite toy, which is a frisbee. So as they're coming out of this tunnel for that second time, we'll give them a frisbee toss, and I will be keeping time and stop their time as soon as that catch is complete. So to show you guys what the course looks like, we're going to be starting off with another one of our baby dogs. She runs the course around 20 to 25 seconds. And so uh, as she goes through, she definitely would appreciate some applause. And if she has any trouble with any of the obstacles, a little bit of encouragement will go a long way for her. But she's adorable. I think you guys will love her. And once she's done, we're going to bring out our fastest dog and see if she can beat her personal record of just about 12 seconds. So let's not waste any more time. Let's talk about our baby dog. She is a beautiful two-year-old blonde border collie. Please put your hands together for Lemonade. Now Alyssa's gonna warm her up, get her prey drive engaged, make sure she is ready to go, and then we will get her started. Alright, Alyssa looks ready, Lemonade looks ready, let's get them started. Ready, set, go! Into those weaves she goes! Good girl, Lemonade. Through that tire. This is a tough one. Yes, she did it! We are off to a good run. She's picking up some speed. She's on a personal best pace. Make some noise for Lemonade! Lemonade did set a personal best with 17.48 seconds. Make some noise for Lemonade. Good job. Now the next dog I mentioned we're going to be bringing out is our absolute fastest dog in the Prey Drive Challenge. Her personal best is just under 12 and a half seconds and she's actually a local girl from right here in Indiana. We rescued her, or actually we adopted her, uh, from just about an hour north of 65 in the town of Lafayette, Indiana. She's a beautiful four-year-old German Shepherd, and today we're going to see if she can set a personal desk too. Please put your hands together for Blizzard! Blizzard is a frisbee freak. She is crazy athletic. Alyssa's going to get her warmed up and get her prey drive engaged, and then we will get her started. Now, Blizzard loves working for a crowd, so the louder you guys cheer, the faster she runs. Ready, set, go! And those weaves nice and quick. We're going to go ahead and reset her because she skips on. Ready, set, go! All right, one more try. Do it right, Lizzie. There it is. Perfect. Through that tire. Through the tunnel. Over those jumps. She's on a good pace. It's going to be tight. Make some noise. And time. That was a run of 13.12. Just about a half second off of her personal best. But that is still a lightning quick run. Put your hands together for Blizzard.